I'm Dr. Mohammed Han Rashid, consultant intervention cardiologist and electrophysiologist at Apollo Hospitals, Bangalore. Here we take, uh, we do this procedure under local anesthesia where we puncture the vein, the femoral vein, and put a catheter, which is again painless after the local anesthesia. Then we introduce wires into the heart and study the uh, electrical conduction in, form, in the computer which we control manually. We study the various uh, parameters from this uh, SA node, the AV node and the bundle of his which forms the electrical wiring of the heart. So what, what happens is after uh, the study we try to induce the kind of a palpitation which the patient suffers during his uh, clinical stuff. So we will be talk, talking to the patient and asking him various questions, is this the way you get the palpitation or is this the way you feel once we try to induce the tachycardia in the lab. So once we find out the tachycardia, we study, we analyze the tachycardia as to where is it coming from and how is it the tachycardia, whether it is a supraventricular tachycardia or is it the ventricular tachycardia. Based on the various uh, clinical parameters, we judge whether it is a supraventricular tachycardia, which is a AV node reentry tachycardia or AV reentry tachycardia. Based on this, then in the similar uh, vein, we take uh, another specialized uh, catheter called the radio frequency ablation catheter where we take it again to the spot where there is the electrical short circuit happening or there is an extra wire which usually uh, should not conduct uh, electrical system during the heart pumping but it's due to various conditions starts uh, conducting. So we take the catheter there based on the fluoroscopic images and the ECG uh, 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 markings we take the catheter to that position and uh, deliver radio fre uh, frequency heat energy which is again painless within say uh, 10 to 20 seconds the, uh, the uh, wiring is like cut so this usually happens even in uh, household uh, wiring connections where if we cut a wiring then the connection to the light does not operate meaning if you on the switch once the wire is cut there is no supply to the light and the light doesn't glow similarly here what we is do is we disconnect the uh, extra wire or the short circuit which is happening and uh, there is no further uh, tachycardia or palpitation in the future. This is uh, a new advanced uh, therapy management for uh, complex uh, arrhythmias where we, we call as 3D insight. We uh, map the heart in its electrical form. These colors give us uh, information as the spread of the electrical system through the heart. So in this way we make out where exactly is the uh, uh, foci or the point where the electrical abnormality is and we put some those dots which we can see there in the form of dark red or a deep red and green. These are the places where we take radio frequency ablation and ablate. So this is a form of uh, therapy for the complex and uh, difficult uh, arrhythmias which we use. And this also takes uh, about one to two hours the procedure the procedure timings and again the patient is under local anesthesia and the patient is discharged after two days after a day in the hospital stay. Uh, he goes with uh, without any arrhythmias if the ablation is done successfully.